everyone i hope you all are keeping safe in this video i'm going to be showing you how to prepare banga rice i know most of us know banga soup and we've tasted banga soup before and personally banga soup is one of the best soups i've tasted so far but in this video i'm going to be showing you how to prepare banga rice um, it sounds difficult to prepare but trust me it's super super easy and you know now diary of kitchen lover i'll teach you the easiest way to get this banga rice to prepare the banga rice, simply heat up your cooking pot and bring the banga puri to boil for about 5-7 to seven minutes. Banga puri is the extract gotten from palm fruit and is also used to make banga soup. Once the puri has reached its boiling point, proceed to add most of your spices and ingredients like onions, scotch bonnet, onion powder, crayfish, dried prawns and seasoning powder. All this while still cooking on low heat. You can then proceed to add some Cameroon pepper for that extra flavor and your properly washed rice. I also added some Uziza spice as far well. I'm so extra. <laughs> Cover the pot and cook until the rice is soft and proceed to add any fish of your choice. In this video, I used the smoked mackerel because it's one of the best fishes for banga rice. Mmm, this looks so yummy already. All you need to do next is to serve and enjoy. I'm going to be washing my pots and dishes with the morning fresh antibacterial dishwashing liquid. I love this particular variant because it gives my pots and dishes that squeaky clean look that I love so much. And it is also 100% better in preventing bacterial growth. And of course, it saves me some more money, of course. <laughs> because with just few drops of this, I'm good to go. Thank you for watching and a big thank you to Money Fresh for making my dishwashing experience an exciting one. You can also get your own Money Fresh from the Money Fresh store on jumia.com, on konga.com or abari.com. Um, guess what guys, there are so many outstanding deals and giveaways just like my t-shirt waiting for you. Um, if I were you, I'll jump straight into my kitchen now to prepare my own version of the Bangarais and make sure you send me pictures. Bye!